What up, YouTube? It's your boy, J-Toons, and welcome back to another episode of the World Cup Road to Glory, guys. We are going to be getting into, of course, the online tournament to try to win the World Cup for the first time with the squad we have. Uh, we're going to go ahead and start off by trying to fix up my squad. First off, I need fitness, of course, after those... Uh, those starting games to get those objectives done and also I'm going to put some chem styles on our players as well just to get going but the squad is exactly as it was in episode uh, number one we're keeping everything the same Messi will be coming on at the cam position for us uh, due to of course chemistry which I can't make to work right now we're gonna have to stick with Urzil only on four uh, chem for now which kind of sucks and of course six on Roberto and um Gotta be El Shazoo. So, uh, like I said, Messi will be coming on. We also have Lozano, Layum uh, that will be coming on. But besides that, the team pretty much stays the same. And we're going to go ahead and get into our, uh, our World Cup, our first World Cup try. And hopefully we can win it. Guys, if you guys are enjoying this series, if you'd be so kind to drop a like. Let's see if we can get 200 likes. That would be incredible. Also, guys, if you're new to the channel and you enjoy FIFA, make sure to subscribe with notifications turned on. Let's go ahead, though, guys, and jump into game number one here. Straight up, uh, our first game here, we're coming up against and during this time we do come up against some very very strong teams you guys already have a lot of good teams on uh or a lot of good players on your teams so but we're getting started here against uh, my opponent playing in the 4-4-2 uh and hopefully we can break them down again chem could be an issue and really it's not even the chem it's mostly that my defense isn't strong at all i'm using a lot of low rated players and it's not even that they're low rated, is they're very, very slow. I'm talking about like 70 pace defenders and less and like 60 and 65. Um, 70 I think is out on my wings and then I'm, I'm running around with 65 uh, pace defenders, which kind of sucks, especially when we start going up against these bigger and better teams, which uh, you'll see some pretty damn good teams here. But getting started off here, guys, we're doing pretty well. We're up by two. Gotta be able to get in behind the defense. Low driven to beat the keeper there to make it 3-0 in our first match. Uh, and, and the way this works is, of course, you get the group stage then you get the uh after group stage round of 16 all that good stuff you know what i'm saying a, a normal tournament uh so if you have to play I think three to four games in your group stage and then after that I think it's a total of either seven or eight games you have to play to end up winning the World Cup we get our first rage quit here which I'm very happy about meaning that we get our first win again not really confident in my team I do have some pretty exceptional players but not really the best team uh, chem wise and, and of course pace in defense our defense needs work badly but either way we get our first win and that's gonna go ahead and take us in of course to the second game here of the group stage and hopefully we can get out of it we have our three points that we need all right guys going into the second game here as you can see like i was saying players already have a strong ass squad look icons goretzka dyer talking about look at his defense pest check pep uh butlin uh Saul s-u-e i can't pronounce his name properly guys i apologize jordi alba i'm horrible with names uh, i probably will never get better at it but either way strong defense great through ball here for him to get started five minutes in to make it one nil please don't tell me we're gonna get kicked out of the world cup this early it is about points in the group stage but i want to keep winning i want to keep winning i don't want that bad bad karma on me we need to win our games Messi ties this up with a great little spin move there to make it one all in the 33rd now we get Koke to find Roberto. Roberto finds Messi he now finds Jesus he's gonna go ahead take the little drag back to find Messi and he's gonna take the low driven and bang baby it's uh up by one so we are now two uh to one in the 34th we're looking pretty good into the half can we get another one before the half here off the corner Messi now gonna take this to the byline he's gonna go ahead and pass it to Jesus Jesus back to Messi to find Roberto great angle there takes a low driven off the inside of the post goes into the back of the net to make it three to one we are up by two and hopefully we can hold this my opponent now is going to go ahead and pass this off to Hamas. Hamas is going to take that beautiful cross there finds his striker and it's going to make it three to two before the half and hopefully that's all it's going to happen before the half can we go can we go into halftime and we do uh we're up by one in the 52nd though my opponent here kind of makes a mistake we capitalize on it we find jesus he takes a shot to make it four to two that being said guys that is where it ends there uh with the goals we score four goals my opponent only with two we win our game we get our pack and yes i did have to switch into the four two three one to go ahead and hold this off either way 
looking pretty damn nice here as you can see the stats we did pretty well meaning in the group stage now we have a total of six points and i think with nine points we can get through if i'm not mistaken but we're doing good so far all right guys we're moving on to the third game of the group stage and i said it man the team just keep on getting better and better and better as they go and I'm 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 feeling like I, I need I need I need players. All right, he has Erickson, Nigolin, Lukaku, Ronaldinho. Like, are you kidding me? Can I De Gea and Net? This could be the end. <laughs> We're still in the group stage here, guys. Uh, we get ourselves a corner uh, in the eighth minute here. We go ahead and pass this off to go ahead and find my man Roberto in the box. He's going to, of course, score off that corner. Uh, it, it, it was off the corner, right? It was all the goal came off of the corner in the plays that we did uh, up until then. Jesus, great move there with the heel to heel. He does find Urzil, then back to Jesus, and bang, it's 2 0. 24 minutes in, feeling good, feeling confident against a very, very strong team. We get ourselves yet another corner here. Roberto doing incredibly well there with his header to make it 3 uh, 0 in the 29th, and hopefully, we can hold on to this because every time I go up, I end up either letting them come back or they end up winning right that's just my fifa life urzil now is gonna go ahead and pass this off uh, to roberto roberto finds jesus i'm gonna be honest with you you know the whole circle uh with the sun and, and the dark i don't like it i don't like the stadiums like they need to be one thing either shadow or no the shadows piss me off Either way, guys, we win our match there. That is going to be nine points in the group stage. Roberto doing incredible. We didn't even bring on Messi in that game, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, so we just did well. My opponent, of course, I think got it. we got a rage quit there as well. So uh, we did well. Smashed our opponent. Get our three points, making it a total of nine so far. And that means that we are going to be moving on to the round of 16. All right, guys, round of 16. So it's either you win or you go home. I want to win the World Cup. It's our first one. I, I definitely want to do well. Strong team, guys. Kane, Lewandowski, like, Chan. Like, his team is freaking nice. I, I'm very, very, uh, I, I'm very, like, blown away that people have these teams already. But, you know, money and coins, it's going to happen. Jesus does well inside the box to pass this off to Urzil. He finds Roberto. Roberto tucks it in to make it one a nil three minutes into this match, guys. And, uh, yeah. We're doing okay for now, but uh, again, that team is strong. My defense is crap, and we could have some issues. Urzil now going to go ahead, pass this off, and then right back to him. The one twos, bada bing, bada boom. Urzil gets himself a goal as well to make it 2 a nil. 25 a minutes in. In the 27th here, my opponent is going to find some space here. Kane then to Lewandowski. It then falls to Jordy, and it just seems like we can't get the ball outside of this area. You know, our defender gets there, but Kane doesn't let possession go. Bang. He gets himself a goal 28 minutes in. It's now Roberto. Now he finds little Messi. He's on the run, the low driven. Bada bing, bada boom, baby. It's three to one. And Messi, we had to bring him in. We need that pace there. Urzil's good on for Kem, not the best. And on top of that, he's just not as fast as little Messi. So, boom, my opponent comes right back with a beautiful finesse shot from right outside the box to make it three to two. And we could be in trouble here, guys. In the 79th, though, we get ourselves a corner. Roberto again, that beautiful head of his, gets another goal into the back of the net to make it four to two, meaning we just won ourselves our first game, of course, of the knockouts. The round of 16 is now won and taken care of and done. Uh, so we win four to two there against a very very strong team uh it was an even match as you can see pretty even on the stats there but we end up getting the win we ended up finishing our goals where my opponent did not and we move on to the quarterfinals quarterfinal time guys we're doing pretty good I'm not even gonna lie second round of knockouts of course uh feeling uh not so confident when you see this on your screen do you see this like these teams are crazy guys if you have teams like this please let me know down below i don't even know how the hell you got so lucky to get this or what you did or what you didn't do but he has a team we go ahead guys one minute into this match okay two minutes into this match a good pass there uh i think that was sterling to griezmann and bang boys it's 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 one a nil my opponent here makes a mistake trying to clear gotta be able to capitalize on it to make it one all in nine minutes so one minute he scored a couple minutes later we scored one all like 
Jesus Christ, that was a beautiful goal. I'm not even going to lie. Great ball in uh, from Ronaldinho, if I'm not mistaken. And Griezmann with a beautiful finish there. Jesus now, he finds Urzil. Urzil now going to pass this out wide. The cross comes in, and Roberto is just beautiful with that head of his. He's always getting them in, and a beautiful cross there from, of course, our center back, who is playing as a right back for us. My opponent here, great through ball here. Griezmann somehow muscles the hell out of my, like, literally out of my center back. And it's it's GG's, guys. It makes it 3-2 uh, to two here. And then, again, Griezmann, Ronaldinho, we could be in trouble. Keeper does get his hands to it or his body to it, but it still bounces in. We're down by two goals. 31st minute here, though. Roberto passes this off. And bang, boys, it is going to make it 4-3. to three. It's not over yet. The first half has been a lot of goals scored. But it is what it is. We'll try to figure it out. Opponent, again, making a mistake there. Clearing from the back. Messi with it. Passes it to Gabriel to him to find uh, Roberto. And both Roberto and Gabriel have been incredible for me uh, so far in uh, the, the, this tournament. And since I've actually played with him, I'm really, really enjoying Roberto. Didn't play with him much in regular Ultimate Team. But uh, he's doing well for us here. Roberto now turns. Takes a shot off of, I think, Ter Stegen's in net, right? Uh, off Ter Stegen. And then Ter Stegen. Um, and then uh, Gabriel Jesus is there to just tuck it in after the save uh, Ter Stegen made. Now, right here, I hate the fact that defenders actually do this or, or fullbacks do this. They always try to tuck in even though you know that the player is going to move out. The Like, CPU tucks them in. Either way, Ronaldinho doesn't do well the first time, does incredible the second time, makes it 5-all here, guys. We have scored a lot of goals, both me and my opponent here. Off of a throw in here, we do find Roberto. Roberto finds Messi. Messi then passes this off to Zeus. He has the angle, takes it. Supposed to be a low driven, did get some height to it. I don't care either way. It goes into the back of the net to make it 5-6. to six. Griezmann now. Ronaldinho, yep, he comes right back with a finesse shot, and it makes it 6-all. There's 12 goals scored in this game, man. This is taking forever, and I would just want to win. I just want to move on. Can I do it? Matuidi now finds Messi. Messi finds Zeus. And Jesus finds Roberto back into Gabriel Jesus. And what a banger, boys. Seven to six so far. Is my opponent going to come back? Because it just seems like he's always coming back. In, of course, the 90th great ball there to Messi. Messi tucks it in to make it eight to two. And we win the quarterfinals. We're not going home quite yet. We get ourselves a pack as well, which I'm very, very happy about. Again, had to switch into a defensive formation there to try to hold and also um, try to match my opponent there, which was playing in that formation. We dominate on stats, of course, and it is what it is, guys. We move on, of course, now to the semifinals. For our first World Cup, we're doing pretty good. Coming up some, against some really, really strong teams here, and this one is uh, just as strong as the last, if not stronger there. Boateng, Ramos, Jordi, like, are you kidding? Kimmich, De Gea, like, that's just his back line. Then you're talking about Gundogan, Koke, Ronaldinho, like, are you kidding me? Suarez, Contingo, and Neymar? Yeah, this is the semis, boys. Welcome to the World Cup, Jay. My opponent somehow gets there, like, like the keeper gets there, but then it bounces off. It does find us in the midfield. Uh, we get this off. I think that was Urzil to um, Roberto. It's hard to see with the, the damn lighting. Either way, got to be El Jesus, if I'm not mistaken, tucks that in to make it 1-0 against the French side here. We are up by a goal 17 minutes in and very, very happy to do so here in the semis. Jesus, nice little drag back there. He does pass this off to, of course... If I'm not mistaken, Urzil, Urzil then finds uh, my man um, uh, Roberto and, I, like I said, Roberto and, of course, um, Roberto, Gabriel and Urzil have been doing very, very well for us. Uh, Roberto, uh, better than I expected, to be fair. My opponent comes right back, though, runs it with Messi, I mean, excuse me, with Neymar and puts it in to make it 2-1. to uh, to one. My opponent here again, great shot here. Unable to get the ball out of this area, guys. Like, I try to clear, try to clear. It just stays. He takes the shot. Suarez is there. No, excuse me. Sun is there. Not Suarez. Sun is there. And he puts it in to tie this all up. Two all in the semis. We come right back, though. Great ball there 
from, of course, our fullback into Koke. Koke puts it in to make it 3-2, to two, and that's all she wrote for that game, guys. We win the semifinals, meaning that we are going to the finals of the World Cup, and hopefully we can win it. Uh, that would be incredible, especially with the team that we have. It, it's not the worst team in the world, but it definitely needs some work. But we win that. Very happy to make it this far so far. We had a lot of shots, uh, not a lot on target, but we end up getting the... Uh, the one goal that we need to get through all right guys it's finals time all right it's the finals and again I like I, I expect this right I expect the people getting into the finals to have really really strong teams but look at that team guys Varane Loris Boyo like are you kidding me I have to deal with all that crap all right it is what it is man it's the finals we got Ronaldo Lewandowski and Mbappe to uh, deal with up top our defense might be in trouble here in the final. And, of course, as you can see, just blows right by all my defenders. Sitting in the back, waiting for the through balls. He does well there. He gets himself a goal in the 38th. And this game was very, very tough to break him down and also uh, to try to stop him uh, with the, uh, the amount of pace that he had on his team. Off, of course, that free kick here. Koke, man. What a goal. Great cr cross there from our fullback to find Koke. And bang, boys. We're, it's all tied up here. One all in the 80th, though. Ronaldo passes off to Sterling. He finds Mbappe. And Mbappe puts it in to make it 2-1 to uh, one in the 80th minute, guys. And I hate to say this, but we end up losing the World Cup uh, final. And, uh, yeah. The game was tough, man. He had a really, really strong team. I wasn't able to score the chances that I had. I brought in Henri. I brought in everything I could. I just couldn't do anything against that pace of Ronaldo and Mbappe. And, of course, um, he just had a really, really strong team. All right, guys. We got through the first World Cup. And uh, we made it to the finals. And we didn't end up doing so well in the finals. Maybe I should have been opening these packs. I think this was going to continue to happen from now on. Is that every time we get a pack, I will definitely be opening the packs during everything. And that way, uh, hopefully we get some players to end up fixing up our team. Due to the fact that our team is not the best in defense. I uh, love my team up top. Love the fact that we have Messi. But we uh, definitely need to work on things. Um defensively and in the midfield a little bit for holding uh we just we got smashed right we got smashed by that team and we really couldn't do much about it missed opportunities and of course players not being on full chem i don't like but either way we're gonna go ahead and jump right in uh to opening up these packs and like i said from now on guys we definitely will be opening up each pack for each game that we win we get bored straight up which is pretty nice could it be somebody that can help out our team portuguese cm oh baby no um Maybe, maybe he can be useful if we throw a shadow on him or maybe a hunter. I need to get that pace up, but 84 rated Portuguese to add to the squad. The European links will, of course, work for us, but I kind of need it uh, a little bit better there in the midfield, if you know what I'm saying. Um, I, I was seeing Portugal. I was hoping, I was hoping I was going to get my man Ronaldo, but it didn't happen in that pack. I already got Messi, so I can't. I can't ask for too much. Of course, I've gotten messy so many times already. We don't get boards this time around, but maybe we can be, use be useful in our midfield here. Uh, and it's not going to be. I definitely need a right back because I'm using that center back. Uh, we definitely need a right back. But nothing that I'm going to use there. The pace is a little bit too slow on these uh, on these players that we are packing right now. But we'll go ahead and send these to the club. And, of course, we will be also taking care of some SBCs with these extra players as well. So we'll have to see where everything turns out. And hopefully we can get some more bo boards out of this. That would be kind of nice. No boards here. Maybe a right back. European. Uh, no, it is going to be, of course, South American right mid. Sanchez could bring him on. He does have, of course, uh, some pace on him, which could be lovely. I wonder what his his uh, his weak foot is. Let's check real quick. Let's check. Four-star weak foot, no skills, but he does have some pace, and I could use some more pace on my team because my midfield is a little bit slow. Um, and, of course, I definitely need a right back. We'll be opening up the World Cup... Uh, premium pack at the end after we get through all of these again no boards baby come on give me some boards actually give me somebody i can actually use striker is that gonna be oh my goodness oh my goodness i thought it was gonna be sun though i don't know if he's actually a striker or still a left mid uh for korea but it is what it is uh we get ourselves another uh korean player i got a bunch of them already to be honest next pack it's going to be hopefully a right back give me a right back i can use Oh, we get boards. Boards are good. I like it, the boards. So pretty. Come on. Is that, is that, 
Is that? Oh my god, it's not who I thought it was going to be. Jesus Christ, you're slow as hell. You slow as molasses. Nobody wants you on their team. 81 gives boards since when? Yo, what guys, let me know down below what's the actual limit on boards now. Is 80s now boards? I, I don't know. I thought it was going to be an 80 uh, 83 rated player, but I guess not. Come on, boards again. That's what I like to see. Come on, give me something that I can use. Uh, it's not something I can use. It's not something I can use. Kagago is not a bad player by any means, but it's not somebody I can actually use, but I could bring on as a sub or I could be throwing him into an SPC. It all just depends on how I feel, but let's keep it moving, guys. Come on, baby. Come on, 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 come on. Ah, no boards this time, but maybe a right back. Maybe a right back. It's a right wing back. And he's slow as hell. Um, 69 pace. He actually might be thrown into the squad. It just depends on who I'm actually using right there. For chem, guys, I like to have my players on full chem again. Having uh, Gabriel Jesus and uh, Roberto on only uh, six chem is not really not liking it too much. But either way, we get our World Cup premium pack here. And hopefully, again, we can get players that can actually up our squad. Which I've basically got nobody that can actually help us right now. We do get boards. I don't know if we're always going to get boards out of these premium packs. But... Either way, Portuguese, CM, no, oh, I hate this mother. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually going to probably put him in. I'm not even going to, I'm not even going to lie. I'm probably going to play him, but not happy that I got Gomes. Um, yeah, I hate him. I, I dislike this player at, uh, like a lot, but either way, it is what it is. Do we get anything else? Center back, South American. See what I'm saying? We're getting a lot of the Asian countries going here. Um, keeper. Now, I'm okay with what I have right now. And then we do get an away kit here, which actually looks pretty sick. Ooh, look at our duplicates. Can we, we can save the duplicates, right? We can save them, right? Yes, no, maybe so. Either way, send that to the club. What do we do with our duplicates? Can I store? Oh, you can. Store it in the duplicates. All right, cool. So we do got a dupe there, which kind of sucks. And uh, we'll see what's going to happen, guys. We'll continue to play and hopefully be able to uh, get some of these SBCs done. And also, um, I definitely want to try to do one of these SBCs, the Europe one. Because we definitely need to... I wonder what we actually need. I don't know if I have enough players for this yet. Uh, we'll have to see if I can do one of these. You guys let me know which one you guys think is the best one to do. Uh, I guess you turn in the Europeans for this. I guess so. Or South American. Okay. We'll have to see. I'll try to get some of these done, guys, and get into these upgrades because our squad does need some work. I don't plan on using any coins when it comes to actually getting packs. I might end up using coins for drafts because I do want to test out the drafts as well. But no coins or points are going to be used in the World Cup mode. You guys can let me know down below uh, what you think about that. But we're going to try to build our squad just playing the game and seeing where it goes. So kind of like a road to glory. But I will probably be using my coins for the draft just like i said i want to get into those drafts and see what i'm gonna what we can do with it and what kind of players that we can actually get popped because i haven't tried yet but either way guys hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode if you did please drop a like if you're new to the channel and you enjoy fifa make sure to subscribe and as always guys thank you guys so much for all the support i appreciate every single one of you and i will see you guys in the next one deuces baby let me know how you guys are doing in the world cup man i want to know what you guys are packing peace